MKDH here in need of a break from Smash 4, especially considering when Mega Man Spam, <laughs> Mega Man Spam mocks the king of the hydrant strength. What? Seriously, when an when a creative anti-spam strategy is mocked by the very thing it's designed to counter, that's a problem! Ugh. So here I am, I'm playing Phoenix Wright Trilogy, hoping it's not it like ev it's not like every other game, I'm trying to make excuses to earn my ire. So anyway, I'm at the point where I need to break three of Larry Butts' psyche lock. By the way, shockingly, Iris has five psyche locks. But uh, I'm sure. But I. Ha but then I get the feeling that she's not actually a. Com she's not a complete monster who would take perky girls as being per perky girls as uh, hostages. I mean, her brown eyes and over the top like mm, Dahlia Hotworms. <laughs> So anyway, let's try to break Larry's psyche locks. The night of the crime. Alright, now you're going to tell me what you really saw since last night. Uh, you really have to done, you Eddie. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> huh? That was a bit easy. Yeah, anyway, it was awesome. Never seen anything like it. And it all did a good night, it started thundering. I've been sleeping, I'm not sure for how long. Suddenly, ZING! The world is trying to be with night! <laughs> like I took this life in the face by my old grandma, Naomi! And then... <laughs> and then, it was a bad to bring the fire! <laughs> Dusky Bridge caught on fire? Are you saying you sad with your own life? <laughs> hey, who are you giving me evil eye? I don't like the truth! Hmm, I don't feel free psycho locks for me. Yeah, it's working from mistakes to psyche locks. A psycho locks. Which is actually what they were called in Japan. In the Japanese person. I mean, he's still trying to hide something. By the way, by the way, Larry, where were you when you saw this Where did you say? What do you mean? What do you mean, what do I mean? Just answer the question. I'm in the same room! Say to me, no! Where else would I be? As usual, here's Jen Friend, isn't it? Tell each other. Probably suspect lies there. There, it's impossible to put. You can see the light in front of the keeper tree. So let's just the evidence. I'm sure the map should tell us something. Hmm. Oh, oh, there's the rain here. There's the rain and getting in the way. This is the map of the area. Take a look around the vicinity of the Kuda Temple. What am I looking for? I think that should be fairly obvious. The main hall is surrounded by trees, and it's impossible to see the bridge from here. Why didn't you tell me the before? <laughs> One down? Seems like a... Uh, how about it? How about what? You feel like talking now. About what? <laughs> yeah, it wouldn't be that easy. <laughs> it looks like it wouldn't be that easy. Why would it be? You broke only one out of the three psychic okay. Psycholox, if you mistake them for. Leave me no choice. I'll have to move on to the next step. You were in your room at the temple. So then, where were you? You don't know that I wasn't in my room. Who was Larry and why was he there? If I read the situation up to this point correctly, but the answer is fairly obvious. Very well then. It's not my theory. Place you witnessed the lightning. Hmm, it's like the dusty bridge with. Hmm, how was? Well, there was graffiti at the Heavenly Hall, so let's get this! Here! Please stop the lightning strike from Natch. from what? Naturally, Heavenly Hall. Why would I be hanging out in this old shack? It's freezing cold, there's no electricity, and I could fall apart at any minute! Uh, didn't. Uh, I thought Edward never said it was mm, a lack of electricity. Harry, how do you know that, anyway? How do you know there's no electricity yet? <laughs> After all, it's not that dark yet. <laughs> oh! <laughs> In other words, you have just provided evidence to prove my theory. I hear that you've at least once in your life visited Heavenly Hall after sunset. 
two down, one to go. I did it. I'm a bit dizzy. You're in a totally different league from Nick. That's nice. Now tell me, what were you doing at this cold little sex last night? That's what, that's what you call a fair decor. I think you mean a fair decor. Could it be you were waiting for someone? No! <laughs> no I wasn't getting kind. Well, I can eat this last night. You were waiting for this person to come meet you. Well, Larry's been... <laughs> I'm talking about girls, 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 so there's only one person you can be talking about, and it ain't my fate. It's Iris! There's only one person you think we're in a horrible place like this, Larry. I tell you before, don't tell me, Larry! The person you were waiting for was Iris. Suddenly I feel cold all over, Angie! Yeah! <laughs> Not all because of my chilly glare. You think I got the odds from Sister Iris, huh? <laughs> Come on! It... <coughs> it's not obvious, Larry! <laughs> you have some kind of evidence! Ev <sighs> got something to prove that I was waiting for? Are you just guessing? This is where I draw the line and then this ridiculous little thing. Here's the evidence that proves you were for Iris. <sighs> well, we're going to have to find something. I'm sure it will relate to Heavenly Hall. I mean, seriously. Wait a minute. Not the Iris. The Iris of has a good attempt of salutation. Yeah, that sounds stupid. Salutation. Yeah. What the heck? I don't get the... Ten at Heavenly... Tell me, this is not the correct answer. Please, game. Just please, be like me. You just called her to this spot with a pathetic blackmail letter. Uh, hey, get that thing! You're embarrassing me. Spite me, Larry. You deserve it. You need you. I misjudged you, Lily. You're not the only one, Edgeworth! This is low! Even for Larry! What do you mean? Taking advantage of a woman's frailty, Lily. You should be ashamed of yourself. But, uh, uh, all, what is the of the letter? It's just salutation. That bit of data that my greater brain for dummy! You're not supposed to actually write that. That's what you're supposed to write to your eyes. Is Oh my god! What? 